Hi, excuse me, sir. I'm so sorry to bother you. I'm trying to give away this iPhone for free or you can have food. What would you rather pick, an iPhone or food? I would choose food. You want to take the food instead? Are you sure that there's no there's no catch? Like you can literally walk away with this iPhone. It's more than a thousand dollar. I won't be able to afford an iPhone. You can't afford an iPhone. Okay, you know what? Do you mind closing this box for me real quick? Um, were you trying to like fix the bike or something? Yeah, Just go and close this. Uh, ask me trying to go find something to eat. Find something to eat. Yeah. I am so sorry. Do, do you mind if we if we sit here for a second, like right here? Okay. Um, yeah, you can you can leave your bike here. I'm gonna I'm gonna sit with you right here. Uh, so, when was the last time you actually ate? A and a half ago. A one and a half a day ago. Yeah. You haven't ate since then. Yeah. Why? I'm so sorry. And um, how? So this this is this is where you're living right now. Yeah. How long have you been living here? About a year. A year. A year. And do you remember the reason? What exactly happened? How did you end it up here? Prison. So you went to prison. Yeah. And again, you don't have to share this if you don't want to. What exactly happened? How did you end up in prison? I went to prison uh, about a case that wasn't really solved and my innocence wasn't proven. Oh, so, so somebody kind of like blamed you for something you did not do. Exactly. Wow. And how long were you in there for? 10 years. No freaking way. You were in there 10 years for something you never did. I promise you. Guys, this is ridiculous. Like how can, oh my God, I'm so sorry, man. I just feel so sad right now and I feel so bad. Like you wasted 10 years for something you did not do. And what about your family? Did they not try to fight it for you? Or do you have any family? Um, both of my parents are gone. My mom, she passed my last two years before I came home. Oh my um, God. My dad just passed. Uh, December 17th of oh, last year yeah oh my god and I am so sorry man I what you're going down through. here and this is where I landed so I am so sorry man this this feels like sometimes the situation in life brings us to 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 you know situations where we have no choice and no control over it um, have you not tried finding a job or somebody tried to help you like your cousins siblings or anybody you have that that, that I could have tried to very give? short amount of time um you know they do have their own families right um and i do understand that i am an adult right um i even stayed with my sister and you know i didn't want people to think that i came down here to mooch or whatever mm -hmm. you know i want them to know that i am capable of taking care of myself at times um you know i just but your sister did help you in the start you were yeah, staying with her yeah she did and, and then then what exactly sister. happened like you you just decided to move out of there um it's We've never been, been able really to live underneath the same roof. You know, it's, okay. it's not her fault. It's not my fault. It's just that we've never been close like that. Um, I know she loves me because she's given me help since I've been down here. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, and and I, I love her for that, her and her husband. Um, but it's just, you know, that's her home. And yeah, you I'm, respect I'm trying that. trying to find... I think if, 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 um, if I... This is like my push to go forward. You know, right, to right, right. To help me do something different. And yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I believe it's going to get better for me. Yes, yes. Good days are coming, man. I, I love that you do have the uh, positive mindset because a lot of people living here would not even think about positive that they're like, it is what it is. I'm not going to get out of here. But you think that good days are coming. coming. Good things are coming. I know they're coming. You, you know. I know exactly when. But ben, I but it's coming. I got faith in my heart that it's coming. Wow, bro. I, I, I love that positivity. Like you're so positive. If anything you could say to your sister and her husband, what would you say to them right now? I love you and thank you very much. Hey man, you, you are such an amazing person. You, you do appreciate them. Like, you know what? Honestly, if me or anybody would be in your situation, you know, the first thing they would say is like, yeah, my sister didn't help me. Yeah, here and there, but, but you're not like that. You're even every little thing that she's done for you, you still appreciate it. And you're like, you know what? That's too much. Whatever she has done for me, it's, it's a lot, it's right? A lot. That's and the most she, she could do. That. Yeah, the most she could do for me. And she, she, she's actually done it for me. So, so that's amazing. Now, as far as food wise, where do you usually find food or what happens in the dark? Like, do you have electricity here or how do you? I have a solar panel. Oh, you do? Yeah, okay. Um, uh, I got blessed with that. Um, Somebody gave it to you? Yeah. And um, like today they have feeds. Uh, they pass out pizzas. Sometimes they also give you hygiene products. Um, 
There's oh, okay. another feed, I believe, on Thursdays uh, is down further, but we have some help, you know, from nice. people that are that's good. to come out and help us. And that's, so, that's, there's, humanity is alive, you know, there's still good people out there that are willing to help. And as far as the shower, where do you take your shower or use the bathroom? How do you do that? Uh, restroom, I try to make it up to 7-Eleven. Okay. Know, they, they don't complain too much, you know, it's like I go in there hourly. Okay. You know, um, I'm so grateful that they're just right down the street and I have a bike. So, oh, okay. You know, that's the restroom. You and you, you have to buy something because you, they're usually like used for customers only or something yeah, like that? Yeah, when I have uh, my food stamps, I'm able to, you know, purchase a soda and some chips or something and then, you know, they really don't mind. Okay. You know, but I, I but they, they kind of like know you whoever yeah, is they, there. They, they know, but they okay. also know I don't want to leave a mess or anything. I'll okay. how I found it. You That's know. good. You, you, you respect that. And a I lot of a lot of people have uh, put the bad name out there. And yeah. that's why a lot of people actually look down on homeless people because there's the bad ones too that actually make the good ones like you look bad. Yeah, they don't like, like the one person that are the bad makes the other 99% look bad. So not everybody has the same situation of just because they were into drugs or doing bad things, they ended up on the street. Look at you. You had a so crazy story. Like you ended up on the street because for something you did not do, and they blamed you and put you in prison for 10 years and bow like it's it's just crazy man just thinking about this i'm so sorry i mean all, that's all i can say but if there's something i could do for you i guess today was the right day um let me be honest with you look at me i went to so many people and guess what people were taking food or the iphone what do you think that most people would take i would think they i would hope if they're in my situation they would take some food if in there in your but i i see a lot of people actually take the iphone you're the first person today that decided to take the food since you decided to do that i wanted to go ahead and let you know and want you to actually open this and see there's something in there there's there's actually no food but there's actually thirty thousand dollar cash for you man yep since you decided to pick the right thing man i wanted to do the right thing for you man food that's that's that could get you a lot of food man and food. fix your situation man i hope god bless you man and you. we need more people like you who are willing to you know do the right thing not be greedy you know because the world we live in people have greed they ask for things they want free things but you're not like that so i love that god bless you okay Thank take care you.